Hello everyone, Geoff here with another Wolfenstein Enemy Territory True Combat Elite mod video. This time I will be doing a body count match and I will be using a Sig Sawyer. Now just bear with me, my ping spikes up and down a lot during this, but I think for the most part it's pretty good. I state that right now I'm on the team where we have 6 people and they have 8 people, and I don't really like that. but. More for me, I suppose. Now here, I make sure to lean around here because it's a nice long hallway. I can get a steady shot in, and leaning will make it so that they won't be able to get to me. It's especially effective because as they come down here, they're going to be looking down and then looking up, and they won't have any time to get their mouse cursor over to where I am. I just kind of move back and forth, scouting a couple different areas, because my teammates have a, a good setup here. They've got most of the sides covered. So I just keep looking around. I can kind of peek up over here and get this guy without being exposed too much. Gotta be careful around here just because there's so many different angles that they could attack me from. And then I see that guy, but he's way too far off for me. There's no way I'm gonna be able to hit him. So instead I go up here. I start getting shot, but then my teammate saves me there. So I'm good now. My teammate gets pegged down by that guy. But I catch him just as he gets out. And then he says I'm a camper. Which is kind of funny considering I've been moving this entire time. Now, I am in critical condition here, red and everything except for my head, so I've got to play very carefully. I just listen, and watch, and I know this guy died, which means that there's an enemy around, and I'm hoping that he just reloaded, and of course that guy pegs me down because I've got no health left. And he says that he saw me there again, but... As I stated before, I keep moving around, so yeah, I'm not really camping. And I pretty much missed that guy, but I get him second time around. There. Now that Will High M guy, he's got really good aim, and I usually can't beat him, but I kind of caught him off guard there. Just scout around, looking for people. Oh, and then Go Rocks gets me, and he's very good too. And of course, I'm not so good. These videos are here for you to learn from my mistakes, after all. I decide to take an alternate path here. And I always hear people around. So, I scout a little bit. And I think I heard a guy try and flank us by going over here. So, I go and check. But no one was actually there. Still always worth a try, though. If you can prevent your own team from getting flanked, it's very, very good. And there I use a technique where I crouch as I fire. And then I call him a camper, of course, because I don't like him for calling me a camper. Crouching as you do no-scoped fights like that is really effective, though. It increases your accuracy, and also, they tend to aim for your head, you know? And so... As they aim for your head, you will crouch, and then they will be actually aiming above you and not hit at all. So it's offensive and defensive at once. Try and hit that guy from long range, but uh, can't get him because he's killed by my teammates already. That guy throws a grenade at me but fails. Now you'll see my uh, you'll see me spinning around a whole lot here. In, and in all my videos, but that's just because I have my sensitivity on really high. I always play right up in the rough and need to spin around a lot to fight effectively. Um, but if you're someone like a long range fighter or a uh, sniper, then it's better just to have it on a lower setting like maybe 3 or 5 as opposed to the 10 or 15 I usually have mine on. And I guess I can't say 3 to 5 or 10 to 15 because not all games have the same numbers. 
I tend to have my settings in the top uh, top quarter or so of the sensitivity and for long fighting it's better probably to have it around the first third or so as you can see I just spun around several times right there now having your mouse sensitivity on high won't just guarantee that you'll win a fight or anything in fact it's pretty bad if you're good at aiming for the head because when you're good at aiming for the head you want to fine tune it a little bit and you want to just use very small movements but when it's set on as high as mine is at least then it tends to flick around and miss their head entirely but since when I'm aiming I do use very small movements uh, I go for it generally I'm very glad that they have uh, med packs in these games for whenever you kill an enemy just because you run low on health pretty quickly if you get hit even two or three times I just kind of move around as you can see my teammates have the areas uh, pretty well pegged out except for over here so I'm gonna just check real quick and then I think I will end part one here because as you can see I checked for a person nobody was there but there was the end.